Assalamu alaikum everyone. My name is Muhammad Amin. Today I am here to solve the already asked question in the Scaltech scholarship test. Today's question is from the integral portion. Find the definite integral. Integral from lower limit pi by 3 to upper limit pi by 2 del x divided by 3 plus cos of theta. The options are available. So let's try to solve the given definite integral. Integral from lower limit pi by 3 to upper limit pi by 2 del x divided by 3 plus cos of x. Here the substitution u is equal to the tangent x by 2 by taking differentiation del u is equal to the 1 by 2 secant square x by 2 del x. Now the 2 in the other side it gives us 2 into del u is equal to the 1 plus now the secant square x by 2 is equal to the 1 plus tangent square x by 2 from the identity secant square theta is equal to the 1 plus tangent square theta. Okay. Now it gives it becomes 1 plus tangent square x by 2 into del x. Now here replacing the value of u is equal to the tangent x by 2. In the denominator it's become 2 del u divided by 1 plus u square is equal to the del x. From the integral we have to replace the del x with the with 2 del u divided by 1 plus u square. Also the cos of x have needed to be replaced to from the double angle identity we know that cos of 2 theta is equal to the 2 time cos of theta minus 1. Okay, here for cos of x it become cos of x is equal to the 2 into cos square x by 2 minus 1. Okay, in the denominator the cos square becomes secant square x by 2. By taking LCM it gives us secant square x by 2, 2 minus secant square x by 2. Okay, from the identity we know that secant square theta is equal to the 1 plus tangent square theta. In place of this secant square x by 2, we can replace 1 plus tangent square x by 2. And in the denominator, the secant square x by 2 also become equals to the 1 plus tangent square x by 2. Okay, now, now it's become 2 minus 1 minus tangent square x by 2 divided by 1 plus tangent square x by 2. So it gives us cos of x is equal to the 1 minus 10 square x by 2 divided by 1 plus 10 square x by 2. By replacing the value of u from tangent x by 2, it gives us 1 minus u square divided by 1 plus u square. So from the integral, the cos of x can be replaced with 1 minus u square divided by 1 plus u square. The limits values also changes because the substituent here is used. So u is equal to the 10 x by 2 is the substituent. The lower limit here was pi by 3. So by replacing u is equal to the 10 x by 2, the lower limit pi by 3 can also be replaced. So by placing the value of pi by 3 in place of x, it gives us y is equal to the 10 pi by 6. And the tangent pi by 6 means tangent 30. And tangent 30 gives us 1 divided by under root 3. So, so the pi by 3 lower limit changes to 1 by under root 3 for the substituent u is equal to the tangent x by 2. And the upper limit pi by 2 also changes. And placing it in the substituent, it gives us 10 is equal to the pi by 4 and it is equal to the 1 because tangent of 45 gives us 1. So the upper limit pi by 2 is replaces to 1. Now the integral, the lower limit now replaces to 1 by under root 3 and the upper limit is replaces to 1. And in place of del x, we have to place 2 del u divided by 1 plus u square into 1 divided by 3 plus in, cos, in place of cos theta, we have to place 1 minus u square divided by 1 plus u square. Here 2 is the common which comes out from the integral. So the integral lower limit 1 by under root 3 to upper limit 1 del u divided by 1 plus u square. By taking the LCM here is 1 plus u square. It gives us 3 into 1 plus u square plus 1 minus u square divided by 1 plus u square. Here 1 plus u square in the denominator will cancel out with this 1 plus u square. So the integral become 2 into lower limit 1 by under root 3 to upper limit 1 del u divided by the height. It gives us 3 plus 3 u square plus 1 minus u square. Now 3 plus 1 gives us 4 and 3 is u square square minus u square it gives us 2 u square okay now by taking 2 common from the denominator it gives us 2 by 2 into integral lower limit 1 by under root 3 into upper limit 1 del u divided by 2 plus u square okay 
So it's equal to the integral lower limit 1 divided by n rho 3 to upper limit 1 del u divided by the 2 here can also be written as n rho 2 whole square plus u square. Because we know a well known formula that del x divided by a square plus x square integral is equal to the 1 divided by a into tangent inverse x by a. Okay, now this integral is set with the formula 1 divided by a square plus x square. So it is equal to the 1 divided by a into tangent inverse x by a. Here the a is on root 2. So it gives us uh, integral is equal to the 1 divided by on root 2 tangent inverse u divided by on root 2 from lower limit 1 by 3 to upper limit 1. Now by applying the lower limit and upper limit it gives us 1 divided by on root 2 into tangent inverse 1 divided by on root 2 minus tangent inverse 1 divided by n root 2 in place of u we have to place 1 divided by n root 3 so it gives us 1 divided by n root 2 into 1 by n root 3 okay now the final va value will be integral is equal to the 1 divided by n root 2 into tangent inverse 1 divided by n root 2 minus tangent inverse 1 divided by n root of 6 by comparing the final results with the option it gives us the last option option number e so the answer for this question is option E. Thank you for watching. Allah Hafiz.